about a rough arrest in Hallandale Beach. A concerned citizen alerted us to video of the arrest earlier today. Now, here's a part of it. No, bro, what is that? You got on the ground before you Now, the arrest happened yesterday afternoon on Hallandale Beach Boulevard. According to the arrest report, the man was accused of stealing a phone from a car. In the report, one of the arresting officers says the suspect resisted and wouldn't let them handcuff him. He says a taser failed to subdue him and wrote in the report dated yesterday that he hit him several times with a baton. Now, Hallandale Beach Police just wrapped up a news conference about this, and CBS 4's Oralia Ortega is there. Oralia, what did they say? Uh, well, Elliot, they said that an internal affairs investigation is currently underway. They just uh, finished this news conference just a couple of minutes ago, and we have the city manager, Roger Carlton, who can join us now and give us an update on uh, what is going on uh, with the situation. Good evening. Uh, Hello. Hello. Uh, we have had a situation that occurred today in Hallandale Beach where two officers and a citizen were involved in an altercation uh, that was recorded on video. First look at the video is of concern, but I want everybody in our community and everybody who is uh, uh, watching this to understand that the city of Hallandale Beach, uh, the manager, uh, the mayor, uh, and our police chief, Sonia Quinones, uh, will be investigating this. There are procedures that are underway uh, in an internal affairs investigation. The two officers have been placed on administrative leave, and we will be working expeditiously to uh, investigate and resolve this matter. Any idea how long this investigation may take? It's very hard to tell because in Florida you have something called the Policeman's Bill of Rights, which protects police officers. Uh, we have to gather video from nearby stores, uh, but this will be done expeditiously. Uh, from the, the person who posted the video on Twitter called this police brutality. Do you see this as police brutality? It's something that I think is an unfair statement without all the facts. We want to look at the video of what happened uh, prior to this, uh, what condition the uh, uh, person was in, uh, the history of the officers, and there's just a whole complex series of things that happen in a fair and balanced internal affairs investigation, and they will be done. It is very premature to draw any conclusions from the video. Right. Thank you so much for your time. We appreciate it. And uh, something else that they mentioned during the news conference is that there is surveillance video uh, showing the incident or part of it, and they expect to get their hands on that sometime tomorrow. Uh, so, again, an internal affairs investigation is underway after this video was posted on Twitter that alleges police brutality. For now, reporting live in Hollandale Beach, Aurelia Ortega, CBS 4 News at 7.